hello student now today in this session of class 12 business studies we will be going to discuss about the merits and the demerits of the external sources of recruitment external source of recruitment it is that source of recruitment in which we are calling the candidates from outside the organization to fill the vacant post we have already discussed in the previous session that what is recruitment for us what is internal source of recruitment and the merits and demerits of internal source as well as the various types of external sources of recruitment now today in this session we will be going to discuss about the merits and the demerits of appointing the candidate from the external source of recruitment okay so very first merit in this is wide choice when we are calling the candidates from outside the organization the organization gets the wider choice because there are number of applicants who are applying for the various posts in the organization so the organization gets the choice of selecting the best candidate amongst those so this is one of the benefit which we are getting from the external source of recruitment which is not available there in internal source ek aisa choice hota hai aapke paas jisme aapki candidate ki appoint karne ki jo ek facility hai wo badh jati hai क्यों क्योंकि आपके पास कई एप्लीकेशन आती हैं और आपको एक ऑप्शन मिलता है कि उनमें से जो बेस्ट सुटेबल कैंडिडेट है आप उसी को अपनी ऑर्गेनाइजेशन में जॉब देते हैं देन कम्स सेकंड ऑप्शन दैट इज मैरिड सोर्स ऑफ लाइवलीहुड व्हेन वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट द एक्सटर्नल सोर्स ऑफ रिक्रूटमेंट सो दीज आर द सोर्सेज लाइक एडवर्टाइजिंग placement agencies or the social websites so what we are doing we are providing the informations to them let's say if we are making the use of the advertising agency so we are providing the information to the advertising agency that we need a particular type of persons for filling the vacant post in the organization so the advertising agencies are charging some amount of fees from us for publishing that information so it may be in the form of audio media video media print media av media anything okay so it provides the livelihood directly or indirect to the number of persons who are involved there in the advertising agency same thing with placement agency and other networking sites who are also providing this services social sites there are number of social sites who are taking the informations from the clients or the customers and they are giving this information to the needed person and then they are charging certain amount of fees from them for making the use of their site okay then comes we can procure highly qualified person through this source of recruitment because we require the professional person for doing a particular type of job we require the qualified person for doing a particular type of job that thing might not be possible while selecting the candidates from within the organization because there is a limitation those candidates who are already working in the organization may not possess that type of qualification so we have to call the candidate from outside the organization through the external sources so we get the opportunity that we are getting the highly qualified person from these sources who can fulfill the requirements of the organization related with the particular job then comes it also meets the need of the increasing demand with the increase in the demand there is the need for the growth and the expansion of the business and for the growth and the expansion of the business we require manpower and those manpower we can get from the external sources because 
if we need a particular type of manpower skilled person for doing the diversification activities in the business or for doing the expansion of the business so that person may not be available within the organization so we have to call that person from outside the organization so for meeting the requirement of the growth and the expansion of the business we make the use of the external sources of recruitment then comes it develops the competitive spirit it creates the spirit of competition among the existing employee because the existing employee if they knew this thing that the appointments can be made from outside the organization for a particular type of work so this creates the feeling of competition in those employees that why we should not be appointed at that particular post so they start working with more zeal and enthusiasm because they knew this thing there is a competition and if we are working in the proper manner so we can get that particular post which can be filled by calling the person from outside the organization or hiring the person from outside the organization so this develop a spirit of competition amongst the existing employee and ultimately it proves beneficial for the organization so these were some of the merits of the external sources of recruitment now we talk about the demerits of the external source of recruitment iske nuksan kya hai so when we are talking about the demerits of the external sources of recruitment the first demerit there might be some resentment in the employees employees mein kuch resentment ho sakta hai resentment means the employees might not like this thing that the outside persons are being appointed in the organization for doing a particular type of task in place of giving that job to the existing employee so it creates a resentment in the existing employees and when this resentment take place in the existing employees they think that they are not being treated as an important part of this organization that's why the work which should be given to them is going to some other person so ultimately it demotivates them and it discourages the existing employees so this is one of the drawback man mein ek feeling aa jati hai ek baat aa jati hai ki hum itne saalon se kaam karte hue bhi is organization ke important part nahi ban pa rahe hain isiliye ye jo post hai kisi dusre vyakti ko ya bhari vyakti ko di ja rahi hai so ultimately एक डिमोटिवेशन हो जाता है और एक डिस्करेजमेंट क्रिएट होता है अमंग्स द एग्जिस्टिंग एम्प्लॉय दिस इज अ वेरी लेंथी प्रोसेस अनदर ड्रॉबैक द प्रोसेस ऑफ अपॉइंटिंग द पर्सन और रिक्रूटिंग द पर्सन फ्रॉम द एक्सटर्नल सोर्स ऑफ रिक्रूटमेंट इज अ वेरी लेंथी प्रोसेस बिकॉज वी हैव टू स्प्रेड द इंफॉर्मेशन एंड फॉर स्प्रेडिंग द इंफॉर्मेशन वी हैव टू गिव दिस इंफॉर्मेशन टू द नंबर ऑफ पर्सन देन the applications will come from those person and then the various type of employment test will be conducted selection test will be conducted and at the end of the day after going through the medical examination then the reference check up then we will give the appointment to the employee okay so this takes a very long time and by this time period may be the suitable candidates who are already appearing in the interview or who are already appearing in the various type of selection test may be appointed by some of the other organization so this is also one of the drawback this is a time consuming process it is very expensive process also another drawback this process is very expensive because we have to spread the information and for spreading the information we have to make the use of the various medias whether it is a print media whether it is a audio visual media so when we are making the use of the media for providing the information we have to spend the money then we have to print the various type of documents brochures application forms which should be filled by the applicants who want to apply for the job then the scrutiny of those applications will be taken for that we have to appoint the various employees then we have to conduct the various type of test 
and for each and every test we have to prepare the test we have to purchase those ready made test or we have to prepare the test according to the needs of the organization so again we have to spend the money so overall this is a very expensive process that's why this process is mostly not followed by those type of organization which are working on a very small scale this process is followed only in the large scale ya big organization so these were some of the drawbacks of this form of recruitment that is the recruitment from the external source hope this discussion will make the things clear that what are the merits and the demerits of the recruitment from the external sources thank you and have a nice day